The Des Moines Derby Dames are not a bunch of women just back from a horse race in Louisville. <laughs> they are a roller derby <laughs> team. That's right. We're talking roller derby. And hundreds of uh, people gather periodically to watch this sport that's seeing a popularity spurt of sorts. Tonight, a still life look at the Dames. It's Saturday night, and the lights are a little dim at the Seven Flags Events Center. My derby name is Michelle Terskelter. Um, I'm usually a jammer with the Des Moines Derby Dames. Her real name is Michelle Schultz, and it's time for roller derby. It's kind of like a chess match on wheels. There's lots of strategy. Um, so it's not just people out there really trying to get the like big hits. Last spring, I actually dislocated my shoulder. It's painful. It could be painful for some fans, too. We really try to promote a family-friendly atmosphere. So we want people to know that there aren't fist fights breaking out. Um, we try to keep the swearing to a minimum <laughs> as much as people get heated. We have some fans that come to every single home bout. And um, like we have a guy in there in a green man suit. Oliver Powell, I'm a huge fan. I, um, I don't know how long I've done it for, but now I've, I've got the green super fan suit. And it's just, it's an amazing sport to come watch. I'm going broke from because I go to like every single match. It's it's based on a, a big point scale system. But what's really going on? Out there? People knock each other out. I love it. James they are a very fun bunch of girls. The Derby Dames have a home bout, as they call it, tomorrow night at the Seven Flags Event Center. They'll be hosting the first Women's Flat Track Derby Association Division playoffs in August. That'll be at Hy-Vee Hall. That was really cool. Those are fun. Just fun to watch. Did you ever strap on some skates? Never. <laughs> and they don't use rollerblades, inline skates. It's the old 4x4s or whatever. Nice.